Hey guys, it's Craig. So a lot of people have been asking me on the WordPress 2020 theme how to make blog posts where there's some narrow content and some wider content like this. So let's see how to do it so you can create some flexible post layouts. We're just going to click edit post and see what's going on here. And we can see at the top we have a classic block. So that's just a standard block that's available to you. And then below we have a column block. So right in the middle is just another um, classic. And then on the left and on the right is where the magic really takes place. Because once you set up three columns like this, I'll create a new one and I'll show you what I'm talking about. If we click plus, we can add columns. I'm going to go with three. And then what you can do is click on the dotted lines of the outer columns and you'll get this option to uh, change alignment to full width or wide width. So now we have narrow content and wide content. And if you want the middle content to be like not quite full width, you can just set something up in the middle, like click plus and grab yourself a classic, which is my favorite because you get all the visual editors. Then you can click on the left column and make the percentage width lower. It's a little bit feisty. Sometimes it goes down and then it comes back up. But ideally, of course, you'd want this one to be low, like four is a good number and then click on the right column and make that one also 4. So you can see that it's a little feisty, the left one got bigger, and you're going to have to go back and forth and keep dropping them down until they are all about equal so the left side isn't bigger than the right side. And once you do that, you'll establish this nice wide in the middle and skinny on the outsides full width section. That's pretty close there. I'm not sure why it's feisty like that, but now you can go ahead and do your thing in the middle. I read out a nice full width intersection, or partially full width. And of course, you can use this to offset content. Like you can make the middle column, like you know, not that wide, but the left column really wide. If you want to just do it that way, there are a ton of options for you. Of course, you can also make the whole post full width. I believe just go up to document, and then come down to post attributes, default template, and make that a full width template. But then you won't have this nice centered in the middle text, which is good to get people reading quickly. All right, guys, so that's how to create narrow content along with wide content. In other words, have flexible blog post content in the 2020 theme. Hope you enjoyed it. I'm Greg Narayan. Make sure to stop by our new website, Easy Website Ideas, and post me a question if you have any about what you're doing in WordPress. And I'll talk to you soon.